You probably heard some of the concerns these days over harmful algae blooms that could contain toxins. It can lead to illness for humans. But it may even be hazardous, as we reported earlier in the news, to your dog. Scott Brimner explains in tonight's Day at the Beach. Scientists call them HABs, harmful algae blooms, and they're getting their share of attention these days. In large clusters, they're called blooms, sometimes looking like seaweed, sometimes like pea soup. The regional consortium located in the Tom Ridge Environmental Center routinely tests for algae toxins, and sometimes, even though it's okay for humans to swim, it may not be okay for your pet. The reason that that sign is posted is because that water can be potentially harmful for dogs. Um, that threshold is very low, but it's low because dogs splash around in the water, they drink water, they lick water off their fur, and that toxin can be present, and that increases their chances of ingesting that toxin. Perk staff also ask you to realize that areas are posted based on the best information at the time, but the lake water is always moving, and as a result, algae blooms are on the move as well. So use the signs and something else, too. Use common sense. If you see a sign, please don't go around a sign and obey those signs. Some facts about HABs, harmful algae blooms. Algae are single-cell organisms that can multiply rapidly in the right conditions of sunlight and nutrients. Dense formations are called blooms. And while some blooms carry toxins, others do not. With this week's Day at the Beach, I'm Scott Bremner, Jet 24 Action News.